Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel, part two of Harry's tree. It was an awkward tree, and but when he goes up into a tree Harry. like this, and there have been others. Enough now, Harry. I can Come see on. the potential for something to go wrong. I try not to let Harry knows my voice. Now he doesn't always listen to it or act on it but he knows it so I try not to let fear or desperation get into my voice when he's in an awkward situation I prefer to keep my voice on an even keel if possible sometimes it gets agitated we can live with that but I don't want him to be at the top of a tree or in a bad place. Harry, no. And I'm Harry. Putting out bad vibes, bad audio. And he was getting himself into, well, as you can see, awkward places. But this is the thing with Harry. Nothing ever phases him. You know, sometimes Harry can do better without eyes than some cats can do with eyes. I will never stop using the word amazing with Harry because how is he going to get out of this? How's he going to turn round? How's he going to get back down? <laughs> I mean, you can see how, how far it was well, right to the bottom of the slope. But so he turns himself around. Then he goes back through those two trunks. Gets himself behind one of them. I mean... Whether he can see with our eyes or not, that still takes some doing in his dark world to be able to get him, his body, through those two main branches, down, around, and he's off again. Harry, don't, Harry, please, Harry, Harry, no, Harry, Harry, come on this way, Harry. Maybe fear and desperation crept into my voice at that point. He didn't take it any further than that and he got himself turned around. I was relieved. Oh, no, you don't. No, 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 one up there is enough. Jasper tried to go up the tree and I stopped him. Come on, Harry. Come on, Harry.
Harry. Come on, you can do it. Harry. I can't get up there, Harry. Come on, Harry, you can do it. This was interesting. Further, Fergus came over from where he was sitting and he got underneath the tree and he was watching Harry. Now I've been watching Fergus and Harry this week and I think Harry is using Fergus now as a role model. I've taken video of it but you'll have to wait for, <laughs> you're going to have to wait for a while to see that. I put the camera down and Harry came forward and I stretched up as far as I could Please and I managed to grab him higher. and I literally pulled him out the tree but he didn't make too much of a fuss so I think he was ready to come down I think you just put 10 years on my life Harry nor did he make too much of a fuss when we went home Come on. Everyone's Whether waiting. we know, I don't know. Awesome. Hope you've all enjoyed the video of Gizmo. Saturday morning, everyone. Woody. If you have, please give us a like Fergus. and subscribe. Jasper. A share, a comment, a Fisher. question. And as usual, Everyone's we will all see you again tomorrow.